But then I think I really got up, like started getting sad about the whole situation when we moved back in with her. Because then it like, oh, like, I guess it just kind of like hit, like, oh, she hasn't been there. I don't know really who she is or anything. And like, it's weird having a mom and it's weird. It was just weird and it was new, but yeah. So I was sad and it hurt and I wasn't okay. But at the same time I was because I didn't know what was going on. So. Hi, my name is Emily Bulkey, and I was nine years old when I came to the Academy. My parent is Christy McDonald, and life before I came to the program was pretty good. I lived with my grandparents. My mom didn't come around a lot, but she was there at first for the first couple years, but I lived there for five years. So towards the end, she just kind of left, and I was confused but it wasn't really the biggest deal because I was living with my grandparents and it was fun and I had my aunt. But then as I started to go like through elementary school, it was kind of sucky. Cause I didn't have her and I didn't have my dad. And then it was just, it was just weird. Everyone had their parents. I was the only one that didn't have a parent. It kind of sucked. But then my mom called me on Mother's Day in 2013. And it was really cool because she told me she was in a program and that was like the happiest day ever for my elementary years. But then I think I really got up, like started getting sad about the whole situation when we moved back in with her. Because then it like, oh, like, I guess it just kind of like hit, like, oh, she hasn't been there. I don't know really who she is or anything. And like, it's weird having a mom and it's weird. It was just weird and it was new, but yeah, so I was sad and it hurt and I wasn't okay, but at the same time I was because I didn't know what was going on. So, When my mom came to Crossing the Jordan, she really did change. At first it was hard to see because I didn't really know who she was at first. Like I knew who she was, but not like in depth. We didn't have a really good connection. And then over the years, I really saw her grow, especially this last year. Like not even being in the program, but just working with them and working like around everyone. And as the program grew, she grew too. And it was just really cool to see. Um, well, like, I don't know. She just shows me how to be classy and like how to be a good woman. And like before she was just, eh, like that being classy wasn't important, wasn't like, something she taught me how to be, but like now she's like, okay, we lead with class. Like she just really helped me like, just be classy, be a good woman, be good. Yeah. I've changed a lot since I got here. When I first came here, I felt like an annoying little kid and like I'd be bratty or whatever, but like going through the program, they really teach the children how to be better children, how to share, how to be like, because you're living with kids too, so you get to grow and have friends, and it was just really awesome. And yeah, so I've changed, especially this last year has brought a lot of change because a lot of stuff in our family has happened and in crossing the Jordan. And so I've really changed from like, like a little kid to like a teenager and an adult more now, like I'm really getting, what's that word called? I don't know. Yeah. But you feel the growth. Yeah, I feel the growth. I feel like I'm becoming more of a young woman and an adult and yeah, like more, I don't know what the word is. Mature, yeah, that's the word, more mature. Yeah, I feel more mature now. Now I love my life. I love my brother. I love my mom. We have all have a really, really good relationship. And before it was horrible and it was damaged and it was broken, especially me and my brother. Cause my mom and I, we've always gotten like kind of along. Like we have, we have had our rough spots, but we've for the most part gotten along. But me and my brother, we've really had a rocky relationship. And so now, like after all these six years, it's been really good and we're like best friends. So it's really nice. <laughs> 
I really like being with everyone and having a big tribe and having a lot of family because like that's what it is. We're just a big family and it's really nice, especially when we get to go on like vacations and stuff like Tahoe. It's really cool because we all get to interact and have a lot of fun and make new relationships and grow. And so it's just really fun, like having all these people in my life that like I wouldn't have gotten to have before and like meeting new people and getting to hear new stories. And it's just really cool. Through all of this, I've learned a lot. I've learned how to love and to like be friendly and how to just like interact more. I'm pretty excited about my future. Um, especially after high school because I'm going to go to college, beauty college, because I'm going to be um, a hairdresser. I'm going to focus more on like dyeing hair than cutting hair. But yeah, I'm really excited because I know what I want to do. And yeah, I just I love dyeing hair. It's really fun. And then and if that doesn't work out, then I'm going to go to culinary school and be a cook. But I'm pretty excited about going to beauty school because my aunt went there and she said it was great and she loves her job. This is Emily Bolke, and this is my full disclosure.